Our next stop on the Dinotour brings us to Raleigh at the corner of history and comfort food, the Agawam Diners. It's the 1940s. They do a chicken pot pie unlike anybody else. Come on in, let's go see it. I think I found everybody in the Raleigh area. They've been here today at the diner. And a lot of people stop in, say hello, get a cup of coffee, eat breakfast. I know you have a lot of regulars because you've been open for a little while now. The diner has been around since 1940. It's been in the family since 1940. It's been a while. So now it's you and your sister that put out great food like this. This is one of my favorite dishes. A great corned beef hash with eggs sunny side up so you could have all that goodness run right into the corned beef so hash. So the hash is our most popular dish in the morning. We have a great hash and cheese omelet too. Being a diner, you have to have everything. I know you have great cakes, you got great pies. Mm -hmm. We're gonna see this chicken pot pie that's done so different a little bit later on. But you also have to be in this area, you have to have great seafood. seafood. People don't usually get that at lunch unless it's a birthday or something like that. Well, don't sell it short because these are Ipswich clams. They are Ipswich clams. This is like the one place I eat clams all the time. And the scallops, they're like candy. They're so sweet right now. Yeah, they're great. It's good scallops, yep. But I could tell one dish that must sell a lot during the lunchtime. And that's the most popular dish during lunchtime, I would say, the Cheeseburg Club. Comfort food, it makes you just feel so good inside. It does. I want to meet your sister because I know you make this chicken pot pie unlike anybody else in the world. And it's excellent. But I don't want to leave without trying some yeah, of your you pies. Yeah, you have to, oh, the banana cream, coconut cream, and chocolate cream. I have a huge sweet tooth, so I'm going to try a couple bites of everything. Okay, How about that? Okay, that's fine. I'll share it with you. Ethel, this is it right here, the chicken pot pie everybody's talking about. That is it. That is our famous chicken pie that everybody loves. It has chunks of chicken in it, our homemade gravy, our homemade crust. Who came up with the idea? to flip it almost inside out. Well, you know what? Back when the diner was started, yep. one of my uncles decided that let's try it this way, and they ended up flipping it over. And you sure it wasn't a mistake that, that now has become been. history? Maybe no one said anything. You people say, well, how come it's the crust is on the bottom? But you know what? It's the best way because you're breaking into it, and you could grab the crust with every fork. Right. Part. You're taking that last great bite right at the end. People keep coming back for it. Yeah. And they also come back for some of these desserts in front of they us. They do. I have to say, we are well known, probably more for our pies. We have banana cream. We have chocolate cream. We make brownies. We took out the tray of brownies, and everybody was turning their heads. Oh, they all yeah. wanted that. They are so good with that chocolate frosting on top. Banana cream. Oh, yeah. One of my all-time favorites. Oh, great. Nice fresh bananas inside there, all homemade, the number one hit. It's all about comfort food, and it's all about relationship that you built here at the diner. It's not a family business, it's a family, really. It's so nice to see the second generation of customers' right. kids coming in. Because right, it's almost, what, 80 years? Yeah, um, 75 years, yeah. Wow. Crazy, wow. yeah. Well, thank you very much for having us, and I hope you have another 75 years left. Thank you, thank you, I hope so too. <laughs>